Last weekend, it was the battle for Greater Baltimore as Towson University entered Hughes Stadium to face Morgan State under the lights. This rivalry became dormant a few years back but was resumed last season. This game marked the 25th time that the schools met. What's so interesting about this rivalry is that both campuses are within 20 minutes of each other. So the rivalry and trash talk is set by the student bodies. Towson has a decent sized amount of black students on their campus. They often joke on Twitter about being an HBCU, but Morgan students are always the life of Towson functions, adding life to their campus. So pretty much, MSU students call Towson's campus Morgan North Campus. The impact of this game is more than athletics, so I caught up with some current SJ members on Morgan State's campus to get their thoughts about the matchup. Hello, my name is Brandon Holmes. I'm currently serving as the junior class vice president for this academic school year, and this game is very important because we got everybody out. We have everybody unified, strong school spirit, everybody from the football team, the cheerleaders, and the band. Uh, we just want to show as much school support and school spirit as possible. My name is Kenneth E. Pierre. I'm the SGA president at Morgan State University. I think this game is really important to watch more one because it brings both sides together, Morgan and Towson, and most importantly, Morgan, so we can get the W. It's the beginning of how we're going to carry out for the rest of the year. It's the true spirit of Morgan and how we're going to enact in not just this game, but also in all future events that we have and the way that we encourage and inspire our students. Hi everybody, my name is Bria Hill. I'm here at the Morgan versus Towson game. I am the Student Government Association Vice President. And this game is very important because it draws the community to Morgan. It brings people out. If you see on the field, they are the cheerleaders, the football team, and it's just game time. But unfortunately for Morgan State students, what wasn't so excellent was the MSU performance. After taking a 7-0 lead after a month punt, Towson went on a 36-3. Yes, 36-3 run to spoil the Bears opener, closing out the game with a 36-10 win. It was not a good night for Morgan State. They had less than 200 total yards of offense and over 100 yards of penalties. They had a few turnovers, and overall, they might just want to get over this performance. Like the SJ members said, this game clearly brings out the community, and overall, it's just great to have it back. This is Steven Season, otherwise known as Steven Thompson Jr. for HBCU Game Day.